bloggers or just um street photographers street photographers yes that's what i used to do yeah yeah, yeah i did yeah and then i went on to uh, blogging and vlogging and <laughs> yeah, I gave up street photography. It's just, I don't, I don't know. I just, I just did. Yeah. You do it around here or uptown? The first time I've been to, it was all uptown. Camden Town, I mean, that was, you know, I lived in Camden Town. I didn't literally, but I uh, lived in Cal London. And then, uh, what did I pack? I packed up about 2019, I think. I got myself in the, in the book. What's yeah. that book called? We've got about 127 best photographers in the world. Oh, nice. I got in that and I think it was 2016. Well, so I was pleased with that. Oh, nice to meet you then. Yeah, that's good. You got an Insta or? Yeah, Insta? Um, I'm on YouTube now. So that's all I do. I do, uh, I do a thing called Scene in Lee, which is photograph people in Lee. It's like a social documentary. As in thing. Lee in Lee in non Yeah. All oh, right, is that where you live as well? Yeah, I work there, but it's, yeah. it's really tricky because there's not many people. You know, yeah. when you're, right, it's lovely to take it so busy, no one oh, cares no, what we're no. doing. I've just took me, me glasses off, I've got you know the old spy glasses, but not one person today has looked at me twice. It's <laughs> amazing. No, it is. Well, I've got a new, so I'm carrying my camera like this. Yeah, I've got a button in the pocket. Yeah, it's it's that that's way. Yeah, so why I not? So yeah. I just see a scene. I'm just trying it out, see if I do. What's your uh, YouTube? It's vlogging with V. Journalist. One that was in, um, where did I get that? It, was, it, was, it wasn't here, it was um, Bulgaria. Wow. So this one's just trying to start getting into photography. Yeah. So we're, we're just doing a sort of walk around, see what we can, what we can learn. So yeah. We can, I've yeah. Got just click away. Here, I think, long trousers. Yeah. <laughs> That's all you do, isn't it? It's just click away, really. Well, I just love uh, people. Yeah. I had, until I sold up all my stuff, I had uh, like a couple of early, um, M5s? Fives? Fives. Likers. No. No cannons. Oh, the, can the Canon oh. 5M is it called? I don't know, don't bloody, they're very good anyway, but yeah. they, they not actually five weren't. D, not 5D. No, no. No, it was it was the M I think it was the M anyway, it doesn't I've got a terrible memory, I've, I've got a bit of dementia as well. That's why you take pictures. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I was I, I got rid of them first and the and the, the camera I kept was a 750D. Right. And that's my best camera. Yeah. I haven't got it today, but that's, that's, that's just brilliant. You know, yeah, about seven shots a second. It's it's absolutely out of this world. Because I was telling him about uh, Martin Park. Do you know Martin Park? No. Well, he's, he's like top, top street photographer. Yeah. He's it's like part of Madden. Yeah, yeah. I've been out of it for five years. I've not done uh, anything. Yeah, I mean, he, I mean, he is kind of the king of particularly he's, British street photography. And since 2015, he's been using an old Canon digital. It's not, it's yeah. not about the camera, huh? No. no. You know, and he uses flash in his street, so yeah. it gives it this weird quality. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, no, I like that as well. I did a little bit of that. You just, you know, as, as it started to get a little bit dark in Camden and you're on your way home and you're heading down to the tube station, yeah. you know, you, it's the time to put your, see your flash on, so. Yeah. Yeah. You don't miss doing that, though. Sorry? You don't miss it doing street stuff or um yeah I, d I do but it's, it's different because i'm doing a lot of other things now as well i'm right. doing not only uh, not only this which i don't know what i call this really just, just <laughs> i don't know i just go around taking photos it's street street photography with a bit of you know yeah. with, with a with a with a with a video camera but i, I do a lot of um uh bloody call it where people are getting thrown out their houses um evictions evictions i do i do five five g um masts stop them going up right i'll stop um uh ulis right so no ulis i'll do i'll do all that blogging right. um blocking what else i've been doing i don't know loads of things anyway right, just, so just busy just busy yeah wow. just something going on so anyway it's nice to meet you guys yeah, matt 
Matt, I'm John. Hi John, Stanley. Stanley, nice to meet you, nice to meet you nice both. To and meet uh, you. if you subscribe, yeah, have do. a look. Send me a message and say, I saw you in the South End. Yeah, we'll do John, cheers mate. So guys. <laughs> Excuse me, your hat just reminds me, City of London, please. Oh, Are you? No. I'm, um, I'm the town Bobby for Saffron Walden near Cambridge, oh, right. but yeah, I've always, wear, I've always worn it since 1998. Have so, you? Yeah, I've got to keep it. Because I spend a lot of time in the city. Yeah, yeah. You know. I like, keep, why they mess on. I like to keep the old tradition going, really. Yeah. You know, I'm, not, I'm not afraid that my hair gets messed up, whatever. I just think, <laughs> no. It's easily distinguishable, isn't it, as well? well is, that, is it a uh, traffic warden? Is it a police community support officer? Or is it. Yeah, yeah. No, it's a Okay, right. You know, so. Yeah. No, no, thanks for, thanks love, for noticing me. Love the hat. <laughs> Take care, mate. You Cheers, bye bye. Bobby with his uh, City of London hat
limited range, including the Ultimate Burger, just 2 89 Ultimate Sausages, 3 49 What do you do for a living? I oh, work in the underground. Mm. London Underground, yeah, it's alright. Good good job, place built. How, how deep do you, are you? Where, what are you doing there? I work on all the lines. I used to be Northern Line, but I work on all the lines now. Yeah, it's alright. Good salary, good travel. Do you know what particulates are? What's that? Particulates. What's that? That's the thing that's going to kill you if you stay in the underground. All the, all the, um, all the particulates, they're called PMs, and they're, they're all the, all the bad things about all, all, um, what's the word? It's all the bad things in the air, um, all right. It's, it's dust, chemicals, metals, and all in the air down there. You know when the train's coming in and, and it's all rushing in? Yeah. And when the train falls out, it all goes away again, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, I've, I've done tests down there, which is something else I did. The safe measure is up to 50 particulates, right? It doesn't matter what it is, it's 50. Tottenham Court Road, I got 782 particulates where it should have been below 50 as the train came in. And when the train went out, it didn't go it didn't go below 200. Enough. Then people down at Tottenham Court Road and other places like the bank where it's nice and deep. Yeah. Tell you what, they're all gonna die early or have serious problems, lung problems in, in particular. Right down and look up particulates underground. Honestly. Yeah, because what they do, they keep getting us in for breathing tests. And then we blow into it and they go, oh, your breathing's fine. Yeah. yeah. Well, it will be until, you know, until later on, until it's done the damage. It's not come, they're not testing the particulates that you've got in you now. They're not, they're not. They're not testing the, the pollution that you've got inside you. They're only testing that you can breathe. They're not testing all that pollution that's inside of you, that you've been breathing in. That's crazy. I know we have a breathing test and all this and that. I you're breathing all right. So what are you doing down there? How deep are you? I work on the engineering train, so I pull the scrap rail up and then I'll deliver rail down there. So the trains are not running when you're down there? No. So it might not, might not be so bad. Because uh, no, a lot I'm, of the... I'm on the engineering train, so I go down with the engineering train. I mean, a lot, a lot of them say the drivers are okay because they're in that front carriage and and they you know they 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 got a door. <laughs> We've only got a door between that and the first carriage. I've been on that first carriage, and there's only and and and, and, and I've got a machine that does all the testing, so I know exactly what it is. I've got it in here. You've got your time on you. I haven't, darling. No, sorry. <laughs> no, I haven't. That's okay.
I don't fancy going down the uh, in them crowds. You know the other lot where we've just been, or even this lot down here. Smile. Hey, I said smile. <laughs>
delicious specially selected range, including the ultimate burger, just two eighty nine. Ultimate sausages, three forty. <laughs>
gone three o'clock. If I'm going to go live, I might as well go live in there, mightn't I? Where there's a load of people. So I think I'll turn this off and uh, get a live on going, shall we? Darling, no, sorry, <laughs> no, I haven't. That's okay. Well, to be honest, not at my age anyway. 